Bismillahirrahmanirrahim Welcome to Truly Taught Pakistan Blog YouTube channel Today we are going to discuss about the classification of hadith Here's the question What are the different categories of hadith? According to the law of Sanad and Madan or the structure of Hadith, Hadith is classified into four categories. 1. Sahih Authentic The second one is Hasan, that is good. The next one is Daif, known as weak. And the last one is known as Modu, fabricated. Let's just discuss them in detail with the examples. First of all, Sahih Hadith that is known as Authentic Hadith. This type of Hadith is absolutely perfect and there is no flaw in its Sanad that is chain of the narrators and the Matan, the text or the body of the Hadith. The example is Yahya heard it from Malik. Malik heard it from Abu Zinad. Abu Zinad heard it from Al Araj. Al Araj heard it from Abu Huraira. And Abu Huraira heard it from Prophet Muhammad who said, Food for two is enough for three, and food for three is enough for four. Now let's discuss how this hadith is categorized into Sahih category. This hadith is absolute and there is no problem in its sanad, the chain and the matan, the text of the hadith. That is why it is considered Sahih hadith. Now let's come to the second one, Hasan, that is good. This type of hadith is absolute but has some flaw in its chain, sanad, or its text that is mat. Example is Muhammad ibn Ismail heard it from Malik bin Ismail. Malik bin Ismail heard it from Abu Burda. Abu Burda heard it from his father. His father heard it from Hazrat Aisha radiallahu anha. And Hazrat Aisha radiallahu anha heard it from Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam who said Prophet Muhammad whenever he used to leave toilet he used to say Afranak now let's see how this hadith is categorized into good category this hadith is perfect but as you see this has a flaw in its chain the name of the father of Abu Purta is missing that is why this is classified into Hassan category let's move to the next one that is Daif weak hadith. This category of hadith contains flaw either in its chain, sanad, or its text, matan, or in both. The example is Musa Dad heard it from Abdul Wahid, Abdul Wahid heard it from Al Hujaj, Al Hujaj heard it from Zori. Zohri heard it from Abdul, Amrita bin Abdul Rahman. Amrita bin Abdul Rahman heard it from Hazrat Aisha Razila Anha. And Hazrat Aisha Razila Anha heard it from Prophet Muhammad saying, When you have stoned the Jamarat, all conditions of ihrams are lifted except relation with women. Now let's see how we are justifying it. That this hadith falls in Daif category because it has problem both in chain and text. The time of the time period of Hujaj and Zuhri is different as they never met each other in their life. So how can they convey message to each other? The text is also weak because Prophet has never put such conditions for pilgrims during Hajj. That is why this hadith is categorized into Daif category. Now the last one, that is Modu fabricated. 
this category of hadith is totally unacceptable. Addition or omission is done in its chain, sanad, or in text, matan. Example is Abdul Wahid heard it from Mubarak, Mubarak heard it from Abu Bakran, Abu Bakran heard it from Qazi, who heard it from Watiki, Watiki heard it from Ibn Dakil, Ibn Dakil heard it from Ibn Abdus, Ibn Abdus heard it from Abu Khutayma, Abu Khutayma heard it from Yazid bin Harun, and Yazid bin Harun heard it from Qazad bin Saad. And Kazad bin Saad heard it from Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wa sallam. He who said, poetry after Isha pray is not accepted. Now let's see why this hadith is categorized into Maudu. Due to long chain, this hadith is considered fabricated. Imam Ahmad bin Hanbal has said that the narration from Kazad are full of mistakes. That is why the text is also not correct and considered fabricated. So, viewers, I hope this will make you understand the categories of the hadith. See you next time in the next video. Thank you for watching. Thank you for watching Tuli Pakistan blog videos. Support us by hitting the like button, share, and subscribe. You can also share comments, questions, and suggestions below. See you until next video.